Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is T, and today I have all 12 of Wingstop's new chicken sandwich. Because I couldn't choose, so I decided to do all 13 of them. You know, some you're right. Come with my name. Let's start with. Let's start with this one. And of course, I have ranch. So the whole point of this video, y'all, I'm gonna tell y'all how it tastes, okay? <laughs> this one is a little sweet, but I don't know what it is. I don't know what this is, but it looks spicy. What's that? I don't know. <laughs> now it looks spicy. <laughs> I think that's atomic. Let's try the Parmesan, y'all. I don't hate it. Mm. You know, I had, some <laughs> I had some cheese for this one. I like cheese. I don't know what to tell you. I know that some of y'all are sick of me. Mm. So I liked it. So the hot honey, the Parmesan is good. There's nothing not to like. This one looks spicy. Money business. Mm. 
So, this is their jalapeno sauce, cheese sauce. I should have made mine. Mm. So, so far, so far, I like all of them. Let's try this one. This one is very regular. Maybe it's plain. I don't know. I think it's plain. No, it has seasoning on it. <clears throat> Maybe it's a lemon pepper. That one's regular. I like the one with the seasonings on it. Let's try this one. This is lemon pepper. I don't like this one because it's salty. Let's try this one. This is definitely a hickory smoked barbecue. I like it. I'm gonna come back to no maybe this is Korean barbecue that's the Korean barbecue and I have some Korean barbecue sauce so I watched Steph and Tasha's video and I think they were right and the Korean barbecue is bomb. I made sure I got extra sauce, y'all. Mm. Mm -hmm. mm. So I like a lot of sauce, so. I think this is a, the atomic, y'all. I'm saving it for last. Let's put it right there. Um, I don't know what this is, but let's find out. It looks spicy. I don't like how much bun this stuff have, though. I could do without that. I could do without that. At the end, I'm going to tell you which one I like, okay? I like the Parmesan. I like the Korean barbecue. Let's see what this is. Mm. This is good. This is a mouth for sure.
I would get my mouth again. <clears throat> I don't know what this is. Okay. Y'all, so right away, I did not like the Hawaiian. I feel like that can go. So the Hawaiian can go. And the funny thing is I can usually deal with sweet sauces, but that one is just not good. It literally tastes like a fruit. So I definitely agree with Steph and Tasha with that one as well. It is not good. So, so far, the Hawaiian is a no. And there's another one. I'm going to tell y'all at the end. It's a no. Korean barbecue, yes. Parmesan, yes. I think that's that topic. Maybe this is a hot. Oh, the Cajun is a yes as well. Let's see what this one is. Maybe it's the hot. Buffalo. I don't like buffalo. And I could do without the bread. I'm not a buffalo girl, but I think that if you like buffalo, you will like that one. It's true to buffalo flavor, so you, if you like if you like that, get that. The mild, I could do without that. Doesn't really have flavor. So this looks like a dry rub of some. I don't know what this is. Could do without that. Maybe this is lemon pepper, hot lemon pepper. I don't know. But. I don't like any of the hot lemon pepper. Last but not least. The atomic. So to me, the atomic isn't hot. <laughs> yeah, I've, I've never had the atomic, but it's not hot at all. It just tastes like a whole bunch of peppers. I don't hate it. Yeah, the atomic isn't bad. Hmm. It's not hot at all. I like the Parmesan. I like the hot honey. I like the Korean barbecue. 
the buffalo the buffalo tastes like buffalo. I like the Cajun. And I think I like the mango habanero as well. Everything else, I don't care. <laughs> but as far as the quality of the sandwiches, the bun is soft. Um, I would like mayo in there or like something to bind it together, you know? Which is why I like it with the ranch. And that's why, even though I don't like their cheese, I like, I want some type of sauce and I love cheese. So the cheese with the Parmesan worked for me. So this weekend, I celebrated Rain's birthday. My baby turned three years old, y'all. Um, we had a blast. We had such a good time for Rain's birthday. I'm going to put some of the, um, the clips of her birthday party in my story on Instagram and YouTube. So uh, look out for that. Um, yeah, her birthday was on the 31st of August, y'all. And we had such a good time, which is why I haven't posted in a while. I've been spending time with them. Plus, I always take the end of the month off just to reset, you know. I take um, a break from work at the end of every month. That's non-negotiable because I have to take care of myself, right? So yeah, um, one thing, I do want to address one question since I'm having such a big meal today. A lot of you guys ask me, how do you not gain weight while you are doing mukbangs? Um, so I think number one, some of you guys assume that I eat more than I do. Um, so it's simple, right? You have to go on a calorie, calorie deficit to lose weight and if you are not having a deficit you're going to gain weight right if you're eating more than you can burn or eating more than you can work off so I'm just I don't eat that much <laughs> I eat a lot for mukbangs but y'all considering that I do mukbangs about one to two times a week and I'm in control of my diet the rest of the time and I work out that means that I'm burning enough calories to either maintain my weight or to lose weight which I'm trying to lose weight right now because I just had a baby seven months ago so yes I had a baby boy named Carter I'll link that video above to show you um when I announced that I had him when that I was pregnant and I'll show you um w when he made his debut in my video and I showed y'all my son um but yeah so that's to answer your questions. Um, happy birthday to everybody who had a birthday for this month, for August. And um, maybe I'll give you all some birthday shout outs for September, okay? I want to give a shout out to Jennifer, P. Davidson, Tamika, Key Chapter 46, and Michael. Miss Rita, Ruth. Yeah. So those are my shout outs for this month, okay? Yeah, so those are my shout outs for the month of August. As always, your time is your most valuable currency, and you chose to spend it with me. Thanks. Later.